Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's G from Happiness and Crafting. So today I thought we'd make a few little embellishments. So they're really, really quick and easy ones. Um, and they're just um, from a bulb clip, a paper clip and some fabric and lace. So they're little dingly danglies. Um, I wanted to make something to go with my new kit. So I'm making this um, journal at the moment amongst all the rest of them I'm doing. Um, so I've got lots on the go at the moment. And I just wanted something with the same colour palette. Um, but I wanted this sort of like a dingly dangly. Um, so I thought I would do some of these. And I thought they all looked really pretty. So it's really simple. Bit of fabric. Um, and a bulb pin. And a paper clip. So that's about it. And this one I've actually popped a little charm on there. With, on a piece of um, chain. So because I've got um, bird cages in the kit, I thought that would look really nice in there. Um, I think they look like little dresses as well, which I thought was really pretty. And they're really, really um, sort of shabby. So this one here I actually made into sort of like, looks like a little wedding dress. So that one would be lovely if you were doing a wedding album or if you wanted to pop it onto a card that you were making. Um, I think they're really cute. So really, really nice. This one's got a little um, angel wing on there. So that looks nice, doesn't it? So I'm going to just show you quickly how they're made. So we've got paper clips. These are probably about an inch, um, but you can do it any size. We've got some bulb pins. Um, we've got some fabric and lace here um, and some little embellishments. And I've also got some of these that I made, which are just little dingly danglies which all of that is a piece of chain which you can get off any broken jewellery and just a little charm and just hang it off so they're quite simple to make and we, I've just got some little um, embellishments as well so what I'm going to do let's have a look let's do a purpley one so you want a piece of fabric this is probably four inches I would have thought let me get my ruler out just to measure for you that's nearly five actually by two so you want roughly this is quite big so I've been using sort of like a four four inches um, but this is all right so all you want then is a paper clip and what I'm going to do not yet going too quickly I'm going to cut this into little um, strips well, not all the way up to the top but you want to make yourself a little tassel so just cut along here like that all the way along not to the top leave a little bit at the top just to um, stick around the paper clip like this cut all the way along and this is what makes the little tassel the tassely bit so that's pretty easy isn't it like that and then you get your paper clip so if you've got any ones that are all sort of bendy or out of shape they're perfect to use on this so just put a little bit of glue around like that take your fabric and just wrap it around so if you've got any sort of like cut off bits of fabric and stuff this is perfect perfect to do just wrap it round all the way around and I'm going to just so this is glue is a bit oozy it's less than half the bottle so I think as soon as it for some reason it gets less than half it sort of starts oozing out for some reason okay there we go so then we've got our little tassel like that and I'm all stuck to it so I think they look like little dresses don't they let me just wipe this bottle off just gets so sticky there we go and then what shall we pop on the top we could pop a little purple flower couldn't we that looks pretty I haven't used these for a little while so that can just sit on there like that Pop a little bit of glue on there and then that's it that's all you need to do obviously you can embellishment embellish them as much as you like 
I don't want to embellish them too much. And then you pop a little bob clip on there and then that's it, that's done. And I think they look really cute. So you can just carry on all bits and pieces. So I'm going to show you how I did the little wedding one. So taking a piece of, you want some, your fabric or your lace to be quite soft. Um, so it's, it's nice and soft, so it sort of like hangs properly. So what you want to do again, just cut up through here like this. I think I did this one on a bigger paper clip actually. So just go all the way up to the top. No, not to the top, don't cut to the top. Cut sort of like two thirds, two thirds up like that so it's all dingly dangly down. Now I'm going to get a bigger paper clip actually. I can get one out of here. So there's this one here. Oops. Like that. Let me just see what that is. That's a two inch paper clip so it's twice the size. So what I'm going to do with this one, I'm actually going to cover this up because I, I don't want to see the um, the paper clip underneath so I'm just going to get a little bit of this cotton fabric like that and just wrap it round so let me hold it from there just do a little stick just stick this round so you just so you don't see the metal like that Okay, so then we want to pop a little bit of this on here just to stick the first piece on like that and then we'll just wrap it around just like that at the top. Easy peasy and then a little bit more glue and just stick that round and then you've got your lovely little it's like a little dress doesn't it oops so that looks really pretty you don't even have it push that in a little bit more if you don't want to see the silver top of it but it's a bit late now because it's stuck so what we could do we could actually hang a little key round there couldn't we oh what else have I got got this lovely little fairy on there maybe I'll hang the fairy on it let's just get the ball pin pop this on there and pop that on top and there you go look oops she's hanging the wrong way there so doesn't that look cute you could have keys you could have all sorts of things on there you could have some little wedding bells if you've got some little charms um, so I think they look really nice. Make sure it's stuck down, make sure it's dry first. So there we go. Should we do one more? What should we do? Let's have another little lacy one. Or should we have a patterned one? I did have a piece of fabric here. So this is pretty, isn't it? Let's cut this straight. It's a bit better off okay probably a little bit too long isn't it well, maybe not so let's just cut it up like this again I did on a couple of them I actually doubled up the fabric so you sort of like got different layer underneath, which looks quite nice. But these are just fun. I'm sure you'll come up with lots of different ways to do them as well. Bit of oozy glue. Pop that on there. Twist it around. Oops. Pop a little bit more glue on there.
So these are all nice because you can make lots of these up and you could have them hanging off um, all your little um, makes that we do. And what I would probably do is just make it look a little bit more shabby, like that. Oops, it's easy. And then what could we put round the top? What should we have? Would that go? That would go, wouldn't it? That would look quite pretty. Ooh, that's a lot of glue. I think it's a bit too much. Okay. Stick that on. Use all your little off cuts as well on these. I can cut it off. There we go. I think that's it. And there we go. So pretty. So look, we've got these little bits that you could pop on. Of course, a little flower. Maybe I'll pop the little flower on. So sticky. Look at this glue. It's disgusting, isn't it? There. Doesn't that look nice? Let's get a little pin. And that just goes on there. So there we go. Perfect. Really easy peasy little project. There we go. And that one needs to be glued down just a little bit more. Just there. Like that. Love that little fairy, that little fairy on there holding a heart. So look. So you can get all your little tiny bits and pieces out and pop them on top. I think they are really, really pretty. Really lovely little um, embellishment to pop onto the um, onto your journals or onto little paper clips. They don't have to be for your journals either. Um, they could be hanging off for anything that you make. Look at that. I love the little dingly dangly bits. There's the little dress that we did. And there's these ones. All of that is here. It's just a little row of those little pearls. Um, like they're string pearls. This one's got a little bit of um, sequins on there. This one's got the velvet and the little pearls again. I do like this one. I do like that one with the little bird cage. And then this one's just a green one. And I've got some little um, leaf. Um, trim along there so that would go with this as well I think so I think they look really pretty okay guys well I hope you enjoyed that just another little quick one that you can do um, I hope you've all had a lovely weekend um, it's summer's actually arriving here in Portugal so I've had my first swim in the pool so it was absolutely amazing so it's really really nice so fingers crossed it's going to be a nice this afternoon um, and I can pop down to the pool again. All right, guys, thank you so much for joining me. Have a lovely, lovely week, and I will see you soon. Bye-bye.